What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another stipulation draft here on the Legacy Cube Hour of uh, the Internet. And today we're going to do a stipulation by I Am Valley Man himself, our buddy Villy. And he just got accepted to a master's program that he applied for in Edinburgh, uh, in, uh, in old Scotland. And that's pretty sick. So we're going to do a stipulation. It's going to be college tip. We must take any card with a book, scroll, college-related thing, etc. in the name or art. Use your best judgment. If none are present, you can pick whatever you'd like. Three vetoes that you can use at any point. We watched you in our sleep. Well, that's just how the Matrix works. What do you What do you want for dinner, man? What's uh, What's our food What's our food option? Well, today is Friday. That's true. It is. That means I don't know. I don't know anything about Fridays. I don't know anything about Fridays. I normally have to work on Fridays, so it's weird. Or sleep, you know. You guys should watch Mike sleep. You get a lot more content out of that. Probably like twice as much content. How do you know about that? How do I know that you sleep for twice as long as me? Well, I don't know. Because I meant you meant for the content. The content is you sleeping. Hmm. If they're watching me sleep, the sleeping part is the content, right? Mm. So Why if you, you sleep this? for twice as long, that's <laughs> twice as much content. <laughs> they look like chickens. We're waiting. Five out of eight players. And then two hands remain. A lot of snoozing and near death. Yeah, probably. I'm no sleep expert, but... Stop looking at my hands, Michael. Weirdo. I can't. They're so majestic. Oh, all right. College related. College related. Uh, la 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 la. And if you guys know, if you guys see anything that we don't, definitely let us know. You think Bone Shredder? This is this is what my student loans do to me. Oh, this guy's like a this guy's a scientist for sure. This is probably the most. This is Bob Nixles, the professor from accounting. It's got to be Delver, right? I think so, yeah. Or Rowling's week. There's like a bunch of guys on there that are wearing robes and stuff. Yeah, a bunch of guys wearing robes. That's that's your college experience. You're like, I know all about college. There's always a bunch of guys wearing robes in college. <laughs> <laughs> the toga party. Okay, Dak steals things that are in colleges. Does he? I don't know. Student of the way, oh wait. That's not what that is. It's a good try though. It's a good try. Hmm. Force of will. I alone determine my destiny. That is a... Hmm. <laughs> this is harder than I was expecting. I guess there's, there's not really anything scholarly in this pack, so we can just take whatever. I'd probably take Force if we, if we played, if we picked Delver. Force is also just a good card. Yeah, right. But I mean, that's my point. Like we we took. Um, that's my point. All right. So, spell seeker. Where's Valor's Reach? It says mages and warriors recruited from across Kylem display their skills at Valor's Reach. Is that a school? Journey to nowhere. That's where I went after I uh, graduated. Wow. 
Oh, Roll Tide. That could be like the, uh, like that weird chant that those, those college students do for their school. Right, mm. So Freebooter has scrolls, right? That's true. All right. Remove soul. That's what uh, that's what Sally May and and is doing to me. Is that where you get a loan from, Sally May? That's where everybody gets their loans from. What about Sally? Whatever you're gonna say doesn't exist. It's not a real thing. So the answer is yeah, no. Right. I was gonna say Sally Mayer. Sally Mayer. Mm -hmm. Who is that? The mayor of all Sallys. The mayor. Why? The. <laughs> Got him. You think there's a school at the Rashadon port? You know what, Michael? What's the exclusion guy's back? It's Ralph Eric. I don't think there's anything in this pack. Oh, compulsive research. Yeah. That's a good one. That's perfect. Buried Alive has a book in the expansion? What does that even mean? I'll just take I'll just take compulsive research because I don't think we're gonna go to that. Oh, monastery mentor. Is That's ment just a monk. Yeah, alright, I guess. But mentor, maybe. That's what I that's why I said it. Grim Monolith? Do you think they oh part prison, part home. That's definitely school. Yeah, I think Mentor is the closest thing. Mm. Mother Runes has books. Mother Runes does have some books in there. Yeah, I can't buy Mother Runes. I like that. Micaeus the Lunark? Got a bunch of candles in here. I don't see any scrolly boys, though. Spell Skeetay. Seraph of the Scales, if you're going to law school. If you're going to law school. If you're going to law school. Whatever, I'll just take Seraph. I don't know if it's good or not. Uh, nothing else in here really has any sort of... I should probably take Ogden Nixilis then. Cause he's I mean, yeah, him. that's definitely what I would take. All right. Uh, Seeker of the Way, maybe? I could say, like, if you're... Take Dark Slick Shores. I want the Dark Slick Shores for the fixing. I don't know how much... We have, like, f we have three vetoes, but I don't know if vetoes should count for lands, too, because then we only get three lands, basically. Well, I don't think there's anything scholarly in this pack, though. I don't think there is anything inherently scholarly in this pack. All right, well... we'll yeah, nothing in here either. All right. Drana. These are actually... Well, it's weird to have Thalia in the deck with Delver and uh, Monastery Mentor. Oh, Billy's here. I didn't even know you're still here, buddy. No, lands are free. No, he doesn't need it. Sweet. Okay, good. Cool, good, good now. Seeker seems scholarly, but it also could not be scholarly at all. Like, he could have nothing to do with education. Uh, land tax? Land tax, I was thinking maybe. It's definitely not these two. I think land tax is the closest one I could think. Okay, Bogard and Hellkite, probably not. Murderous. Oh, not neither of these, I'm sure, but all right. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. I think we're confusing like monastery with with scholarly. I don't think anything in this pack. Jace probably reads. <laughs> he looks like a reader. Also, Billy, if you have any suggestions 
Uh, definitely let me know. You are drawing knowledge. What a shriek maw. No, it doesn't. I don't know why I even said that. A warden doesn't do anything. Yeah, I think a Jace is the closest. Hmm, Marsh Flats is probably nice. Oh my god, show and tell though. Good veto. Yeah, this will be one of my vetoes, because I don't like show and tell at all. I do like Marsh Flats, though, and it kind of makes our deck playable. That's definitely one of our three vetoes. I don't think there's anything in this pack, right? Kithian looks like he's going to school. Eh, he, he looks like a kid. He doesn't look like he's going to school. Yeah, there's schools right there. See those schools right there? Oh, you see a building. I get it. I get it. There's a building, so that's a school, and he's a kid, so he's going to school. Yeah. Yeah, that's not a reach at all. Nah. Pyromancer has a book? Pyromancer does have a book. He's probably just going to burn it, though. He, he is burning the book. That seems... All right, we'll take the Pyromancer. A Mind Stone. That's probably pretty uh, pretty defensible here. I think that's probably the only thing that's comes close. Yeah, we'll take the Mind Stone. This is also some books. Also some books and a books in the same dream. Also some books and a books and the same dream. Mm -hmm. What the shit did you just say? I didn't say anything. I sung something. What did you sing? Books in the Same Dream. By... I can't. Potato Starch Man. By Potato Starch Man. By Potato Starch Man. Roller Rogue, Vampire Nighthawk. Oh, Impulse. Oh, man. Impulse has got some scrolls in it. But I really want this Badlands now because we're playing all these red cards. Maybe we're not playing the red cards, but either way, we're taking the Impulse. Seagate Oracle. This guy's learning. He be learning. Doomblade. It's not Tithe Taker or Doomblade. It's got to be Seagate, right? Yeah, I think so. A uh, busy packing? That's rude. Our reanimator deck went 2 1. An unfortunate 2 1. Um, it's just cryptic command. See, look, uh, what? What are you saying? I can't remember the name of the card, so never mind. Don't worry about it. I am worried about it. You've made me worried about it. I was gonna say Trigon Predator's got schools in the background because it's a building. Why couldn't you remember the name of it? It's I don't literal, know, but it's right here. I can nearly see it. It's also right here. I could have looked on that screen, I guess. You couldn't see the card from over there? No, I could see the card. I just couldn't see like the name. I couldn't really read the name. What's the name of this card? Sin Collector. But what? I just know that from the art. Whatever, man. What is there anything in here? No, this is the first pack, right? There's nothing in here to begin with. No. Okay. Oh, Show and Tell came back. I'm so excited that it came back. I don't Do know we how, have to play it? No, I don't think we have to play it. I think we just have to take it. We vetoed it once, but I can't... I don't think we... I don't, I don't want to, like, veto it. Oh, Phantasm Image, I guess. I like the cards in our deck, but I feel like we're not... We're not there yet. Hero's Downfall. I don't think either of these... I don't think one is better than the other here. Let's take the Phantasm Image. Actually, I probably wanted Hero or Hero's Downfall. It was double black though, and I'm not sure we're playing. Hmm. We already have Force of Will. Do we just want Pact or Magister of Worth? Probably Magister. Yeah, I do like a Magister. Man. Wog. 
Sure, I'll wog. I'll wog this way. A wickaba. Nope, you're just a tree. You're just a tree. Okay. Do rogues learn? Do rogues learn? Architect of thought. Um... Nothing else strikes me as particularly scholarly. Vote for aristocrats in a school. <laughs> yes. Like, I don't do the thing. What's the thing? I bring you great pain. <laughs> <laughs> I bring you great pain. AOT is not the move? What does that mean? I have no idea what that means. I think it means architect of thought. I know what I know what I know what the AOT part means. I don't know what the oh. statement means. I feel like Jace is the closest thing to anything scholarly here, so. No, no, no. I'm leaning towards concealed courtyard here. History of Benalia is kind of a book. What's the area? What then? What's the best pick? Then, then suggest the best pick. Then, like this is an architect of thought that is that is the most representative of what a school or a teacher is than any other pick in that pack I can imagine. So, if you had a better suggestion, make the suggestion. I guess. History of Benalia is actually a book. That's true. I'm gonna take it to the courtyard. I think. I want to have some lands that I can actually. Karn with a book. He does have a book. Uh, you're not doing anything. Like I, I can pretty. I feel like you can still color most of the red cards. The red cards are probably. I feel like this archetype in general, this stipulation in general, puts you in black, white, and blue. White because you got a lot of like, political. Um, bureaucratic cards that have like laws and things. Uh, blue, obviously, because there's tons of knowledge in, within the game, and black because there's a lot of deals and like contracts being made. So like, there's a lot of scrolls and educational things, connections that you can make in those colors. Green is is usually too 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 natural, and red is usually too destructive. So I feel like it's it's pretty natural that you can gravitate towards the esper colors for an archetype like this. I think it's got to be Karn here, right? I don't see anything else close to Karn. Oh, Baleful Strix, Banishing Light, none of those are good. Hypnotic Spectre, no. No, no, no. This guy's got a book on it. He's clearly destroying a school. What a lunatic. I'm going to veto this one and take, like, Baleful Strix, I guess. Is that really a veto? Yeah, it's a, it's got it's got a book on it. That'd be a pick, right? All right. Why wouldn't that be a veto? Because he's not really reading it. It doesn't matter. Oh this yeah, so if, if the art has must take any card with a book, scrawl, college related thing in the name or art. Okay. Um, opt is very very good. I'm gonna take the polluted delta though because I feel like I have to here. It's another veto, I think, right? No, he said the lands are fine. Oh. All right, Billy actually said, uh, I want the deck to be actually lands over anything if you want. No vetoes needed for those. I want okay. the deck to actually be playable. Yeah, that's same. Um, mm. One of those tentacles has got to be home in the book, right? <laughs> you got 30 tentacles. You got to read with one of them, right? I don't think anything in here has. Yeah, Miz, it seems like a reader. Niv Mizzet. Actually, he does seem like a reader. But uh, pretty hard on the mana base. Emrakul is definitely reading something. That's a good point. Because it's not the other Niv Mizzet that had the algebra on it. I think we're just going to take swords here.
Because I don't think there's actually a correct pick in this pack. Uh, hostage taker, anything? Tangle wire, anything? No, 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 no. No burning books on the Hellrider? Brain maggot. There are no burning books on the Hellrider. <laughs> It's a good, it's a good, uh, yeah, Brain Maggot is the, the, with Brain in the name is where I actually, uh, yep, you guys are saying Brain Maggot, so I'm gonna go with Brain Maggot here. Entreat the Angels? I don't think so. Gideon Jura? Nope. Liliana, Heretical Healer. Thoughtseize? Thoughtseize seems fitting. Yeah, I thought he's yeah. better than Vindicate here, for sure. Um, oh, the Mind Shatter came back. Bloodline Keeper? No. Yeah, Mind Shatter was the only other card in this pack that, that anyone's ever was actually discussing, so I think we'll just take the Mind Shatter here. Man, I would really really have loved one, like, fetch land to get with our March Flats and our Polluted Delta, but... Or one, like, Shock Land, rather. Or Dual Land, even. Go for the Throat, Revoker... Crucible, Wall of Omens. Probably just want to go for the throat here for the for the deck. I feel like they're so close to having a, a thing in this art. I'll just take Geist, I guess. Living Death, Gritter Garden, Conflict. Butcher of Tr. Nah. Let's take the Manic Vandal now. Probably just take Blood Crypt because we can get it with Martial Arts and if we ever want to play like Manic Vandal. Hmm. Who knows? Oh, the Hell last pick Hell Rider? Wow, that's ridiculous. Okay, well we need three cuts here. I kinda like this as like a little like a Esper tempo deck. With a bunch of card advantage cards. Probably cut the Dulver. Really? How many spells do we have that that I feel like Delver is terrible in cube because you just can't get enough spell spells. Like how many spells even flip Delver in our deck? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Okay, this is actually more than I was expecting. But I still don't know if it's enough. Eight spells? Yeah, it's actually a decent amount. Yeah, that's more than I was expecting. Deck is mad. I actually thought the deck turned out better than I was expecting it to. We have a lot of disruption. I think we could also get away with 16 lands. Our curve is pretty low. Yeah, but you want to hit lands every turn because you want to be able to play two things a turn in this deck. Because you're going to be drawing a lot of cards, so you want to be able to unload your cards. I'm tempted to... I don't know if Cryptic Command is great here. Triple Blue is really hard when we have, like only two dual lands and one of the like we'd have to have two islands and a dark slick shores or three actual islands yeah that's a good i mean i hate to say it but cryptic command is actually pretty hard to cast here i could see cutting i could see cutting delver yeah i don't love it but i could see it Especially for cutting Cryptic Command, that's only seven. Bad Boss, good games, man. Good games. It was funny because right before you, I played uh, Bat Birth Control, so there were two Bat players back to back. Uh, four, 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 which leaves us with what? Four, five, six, seven, eight. Four, five, six, four, five, six. So we're going to put one up to seven, probably the blue. So it's seven, seven, six. Oh, this is 16 lands. Hmm. 
We have one more blue. Yeah, I like this. Killing all my bad people, not close. Hey, man. You guys challenged me. I was just walking around minding my business. And then I get bat jumped. Walking around in circles. Walking, walking around in circles. Wow, that's a throwback. We have a lot of red cards on the sideboard, too. I'm bored into them. I'm bored into you, buddy. Will you? Do I have a favorite basic land choice? Uh, my default basic land is unhinged lands. Turn on Thoughtseize. Am I the uh, am I the bad guy? Yep. Oh, treachery and mana war and five lands. Wow. I'm gonna get rid of this treachery. Seems wise. That's a good card, my dude. Dark Slick Shores, hundred percent. We're going to play this because if we draw a blue, we can still play Jace on turn two, which is more important. I think you mean on turn three. That <laughs> is what I meant. We did not draw it. All right, let's see. All right, well. The nice thing about Mana War is if there's no other creature on the board, it has to bounce itself. Double blue, four mana, four mana. To the surprise of no one. Uh. Might still into Radrana. Probably give us the Drana. Sounds about right. We could have made an artifact, give them a perfect target to bounce with their mana war. Mm -hmm. That would have been bad. Here comes the Frasca's Contempt. Angrath. Discard a card and lose two life. I feel like it's just this Jace. Which one? The, the worst one. The tiny one? Okay. So if we just get the, if we just get Monastery Mentor, we can play Monastery Mentor. Which one lose a lot of people that are cards in their graveyard? That's not terrible. Oh, they just steal it with this guy? Oh, that's pretty bad. Yeah, we'll just keep plussing then. Ob or Magister are worth. Just give me Magister here, right? Well, next turn we can definitely get Ob out of the deal. Like, if we just play this and they choose to bounce it, that's fine. And if they choose to steal it and attack, that's also fine. Not the end of the world. Because then they just get to kill it. Like, that's fine. They can negative three to kill it. Okay. Um... I think we can just get rid of Jace here. We have an active... Actually, Magister was probably worse. A Braid. Okay. I personally probably would have kept the Braid and... Seriously? Fine. This is really frustrating. Like, it just feels like nothing is coming our way. Like, 
they're just going to sit here behind this Angrath and we're not going to have any threats because they have five cards in hand. I guess it's Phantasmalage here. One, two, three, Mentor. No, we're just going to have to reveal. Let's see what we get. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Two counter spells. Another counter spell. Counter spells for days. Yeah. All right. Seems good. You've drawn all the counter spells. How's the ice today? Pretty good. Discarding a card every turn is brutal. Yeah, not being able to resolve any cards is also pretty bad. I don't know if you knew that. Yikes. I don't even know what happened this game. This game is actually unbelievable to me. <laughs> I have no idea what happened. They resolve a single Angrath, and we actually have nothing to do. This is very strange. Um, I, that was actually pretty shocking to me. I have no idea what just happened there. Take out the Gopher the Throat, bring in the Mind Shatter. Take out the Magister, bring in Thalia. Actually, kind of like Roller Rogue here, over like a Jace Bellerin, maybe. Yeah, I remember when their hand was treachery in five lands. That's what I mean. I'm like, no, it was Mana War in five lands. So it was even worse. And then I'm like, wow, cool. We got to stick a Karn when they have nothing on board. And their hand was terrible at the time. And it was just kind of like, I have no idea what happened after that. After it spiraled out of control. It was a very surreal experience. Well, hopefully they just have no idea with this guy. So we win. That is my hope. Look, we're doing it. Okay, Slaughter Pack, Fatal Push, a Braid, Hanger Back. Let's take the creature, because the rest is just removal. I guess next turn they can Fatal Push, but it prevents them from playing Hanger Back on two. Yeah, that's fine. We saw both on display. <laughs> True story. True story. Having a 1-1 one, one on board after Mana War just doesn't really make much sense, though. Because, like, they bounce one of the tokens, and then we have a 1-1. One, one, and it's just like... I don't know. There's definitely a point where we could have just made a bunch of guys with Karn. But, like, we had no real reason to because I just assumed they wouldn't have double counter spells by that time in the game. Yeah, rub those tiny hands together. Don't tell me what to do, Michael. Are they figuring out which removal spell they want to use? They're really, they're really thinking about. Oh, I believe it's our priority currently. Wait, did they? Oh, I see. I see. That's a good draw too. Are you ready for them to attack this guy? Hmm. They did not do it. They did not. Did they top deck a? Are you ready for the top deck memory lapse? No, I'm probably gonna have a. Uh Pyrocosm. That would be sick. So our 13 cards revealed. Fatal Push that guy. Okay, so Fatal Push is gone. So 
So everything above a braid you still have in hand, including Hangerback Walker. So this should be your hand. A braid, slaughter pack, island, tamio, hangerback. Which is all fine. Because even if you, you can only play a hangerback for one this turn. That's even more aggressive. If we draw a black here, it's great because we can play Jirana. That's what we're looking for. And now they either have to decide to kill the Jirana. Or next turn we get to attack with the Jirana and this, and Geist becomes a 3-3. So that actually puts us in a decent position. You guys know what it's like. You guys know how Magic the Gathering works. This is what they played, right? They played this island. So yeah. we know they have four cards. They've drawn two. Off Night's Whisper and two off their turn. So it would have put them to eight. Or something. Yep, so now they abrade that. They can only play hanger back for one here, and we get another swing with Geist. Hanger back for one. The deck has a, it's like it's funny because we're playing a deck where it's like tiny tempo creatures and they're playing a deck that has a shit ton of removal. Uh, okay, so if we just play Baleful Strix here, like we have enough power on board, I guess they could they braid's gone, Hangerback's gone. They could slaughter pack nothing. They could slaughter pack the angel. I think when they're at five, others have the additional one power on board. Oh, that's nice. That was a pretty good draw. I have survived. You may resume all your normal activities. Done. You got it. Aren't you dead now? I guess you have slaughter packed. He was forced it though. Right, but I mean, like, I'm I'm trying to get in their head. Not I know I know that they don't know that. What just happened? Didn't even go for it? Interesting. I don't understand. Weird. Like, if they pump this guy block here, they take one, right? And then they slaughter pack. And they have two 1-1 one, one flyers to deal with this guy in the future. I don't understand. That just had to be misclick, right? Uh, if they pack the angel, uh, we lose our Geist of Saint Draft to a 2-2 Hanger Back Walker, and then they get two tokens. So we actually have to make sure that we win that turn, because otherwise they have two 1-1s one and a Jace to our 1-1 one, one Baleful Strix. It's pretty bad. I think this is a good configuration. I also think Mother of Winds would be great. Michael has a turtle face. His mother named him Michael after her favorite turtle. Turtle face? I like that you said... <laughs> I like that you just said turtle face. That's nice. <laughs> like somehow I turned off stops and my blockers and I was like, oh, and yeah, I knew that had to be a mistake. This hand seems great. Two playables, a bunch of solid threats, all the colors. If we can hit a land off the top, Dark Slift Shores off the top would be nice. You ready? I'll take it. I'll take it. Will you? 
Yeah, because then we can go Baleful into Drana. Before you take it to where? To the limit. One more time. And take it to the limit. One more. Wow, the Dark Slick Shore says there the whole time. Oh, and we can play this guy on turn four. Oh, boy. Take it to the chicken one more time. Don't take it to the chicken. Why not? It's just not appropriate. I've been taking it to the chicken for years. That doesn't sound appropriate. Can we copy Seraph with Phantasmal Image? That seems like gas. Or Whirler Rogue, I guess. Either one of those creatures that make... More creatures? Are they trying to fail push us? I ain't falling for it, buddy. Fatal push confirmed. Fatal push online. Oof. Oof. That's nice. Both them. Both them and schmoe them. That's going to cost you a dollar, sir. To both them and schmoe them? Yeah. Dang, man. Prices have that's gone up tax. since I was a kid. Oh, that's nice. I see what you did there. It's pretty good. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that. Hey, let's print this card that lets you steal a creature. Okay, well, what if you untap your lands too? Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> let's do it. And they had murderous cut. Wow. Boy, I remember last time I was like, this is looking real good for us. What an actual idiot I am. See what you got here. Nickel Brolis and two lands. All right, I'm game. So, wait, you didn't have murder? Oh, you, wait, you didn't have. Why did you swing this into my Drana? That's very weird. This is all very confusing to me. Do you have any way to deal with treachery? No, but I'll just copy it. It's whatever. If I want to trade, I'll get two one ones for sure. <laughs> okay, what'd they play? Island? Good. Excellent. What's the worst thing we can play here? Like Angrath? That's comforting. That's what comfort is. That's what comfort is. The Mike Bees. The sad bees, all the Michael bees every day. That's just Michael B. I like that he had the, he was like, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep snapping as long as you're You know, you know what I'm saying. No. Bum 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 bum. They drew Cryptic Command? Wow, that's insane. I mean... You could force back. 100% forcing this. Okay. Otherwise, we have nothing on board except for the two one ones. That's such a... Oh, that's an insane draw. Ooh. 
Yeah, force it. The problem is you're only forcing half of it. It still kills the Seraph, obviously. The Seraph, obviously, but... Yeah, that's true. Maybe just let it resolve then? I mean, it's just a matter of, like, is Whirler Rogue better? I don't know. Like, this is four power on the board, two of which is flying. They're at 11. Like, our two guys block their two guys, and they have infinite time to do whatever they want with. Yeah, I think this is fine to force. I don't think it's better to force a threat here. I think it's actually better to make sure we have threats on the board that we can actually win the game with. Like this is a four damage this is four damage a turn. And we still have impulse to try to find something else if we need it, like like, if we ever draw a Geist of St. Traft, we can make it unblockable with Whirler Rogue. I think that's very important. That's very good. Cryptic Command and Deep Analysis. Let's hope we can draw just as well. <sighs> that's very good. And they get three flyers out of it. Four flyers out of it. Wow, that's insane. What is even happening right now? Hmm? Tanos, what's going on, buddy? Happy day after your birthday. Or day yeah, day after your birthday. Yeah, let's we can go with that. Oh, this was This was stupid. Why did I do this? I guess we do get to deal four here, which is not terrible. Um, black, black, blue, blue. Yeah, this is actually fine. We can, if we draw Jace, though. Well, if we draw Jace, they're just going to kill it. And we can always pick something else, too. And there's a different Jace. I think we're just taking the Ob for next turn. I mean, that is if we hit a land, I guess. But if we don't hit a land, we're probably just playing whatever we draw, so... Yeah, we should have just actually we should have made this unblockable. I was tempted to because I'm like, well, you know, we're just getting uh Yep, and there's I get four guys, we get no guys. I mean if they deep analysis here, it's I guess it's fine. <laughs> yep, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Thank you. Well, our opponent's name is Hazard Two, and there's a Hazard Three Nine Two in our in our stream, which would make sense why you left two guys up. I mean, it's kind of interesting if you're sniping, but. Shulk Money, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Welcome back. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah. Interesting. You take four, five, six. Yep, that's just game. Anything we change here? I might just like roll a rogue as another creature that's just wide. Otherwise, I like the. I think. <laughs> no, that looks exactly like Mike. I'm pretty sure that's Mike. Wait, what? You're Thanos' dad. That's you and Thanos. Basically, the same person. I don't think that's true. Well, you'd be wrong. Isn't that weird? I don't think I am. Wrong? I I guarantee it. I guarantee it. You're gonna, You're like, gonna the way like the way you look. Correct. Actually, maybe we just cut the mind stone here. Yeah, that seems fine. What is Mindstone doing for us in this deck? Mind in its own business. Thomas, tell your dad happy birthday. What did you say? I called him right before opening Twitch. Well, I meant for me, not from you. I'm sure you. I'm sure you told him happy birthday. Hmm. All right. Well, let's brain mag it because that hits any card. Either way, I think our first match was pretty close. Okay. Sword of body and mind, the best so three two four drops in a in a sword, huh? <sighs> These are both black cards as well. I'm gonna take the sword here. Cause I'll assume you drew all the other threats. Look at all these look at this. So what, six cards? One, please leave. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is what we know. DJ, what's going on? You should definitely start playing MTG. It's a great game. We do need a black or a blue. Either a black land or a blue land. I will take a concealed courtyard or a dark slick shores at this particular moment. Well, that's really a, that was a great draw. Well, well done. Well drawn. Not not by us, however, but, you know. I still just want the sword because it's like the one card we can't really beat that efficiently. And we just missed the land drop. 17 lands. It's pretty normal, I think. One, two, three. So... Three, four, five. This was this was, I believe, what they had left. We just play the planes. So, you alright over there? You fall asleep or? What am I not falling asleep, Frank? Dude, I really don't know. <laughs> That's my question as well. 
That is the one I asked myself. I'm going to go out to eat later. I'm just going to fall asleep into my food. I, no, because you're, you're, you have energy when you're eating. That's where the energy comes from. That's where the energy comes from. That's good. You said the exact same thing I said. Did I? I think you did. I think so. But do you know so? I don't. I have no idea. Exactly. Well, maybe turn five will hit our third land. We'll see. Only time will tell. That's correct. Only time will tell. What do you mean Santa isn't real? Preposterous. You're preposterous. Yep, that's a good one. Is that in everyone's deck? I think it is, my dude. I think it is. Not actually sure what we can do here because we're so far behind. We could give him an extra card. I don't want to do that, but I had to. But you did. Right? Correct. Ugh. I mean, I really don't have, like, I think our hand is actually fantastic if we hit land drops. If we could take advantage of the fact that they only have four drop, four drop in hand, and we can go Drana into Jace or into Seraph or into Whirler or into Obnixilis, like, we're actually in great shape. However, when Magic is like, you know what? Why don't we let one player play the game this turn? Or this game. And uh, the other one can just watch. That makes it less less fun. Less likely. Yep. 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 Look at this creepy weirdo. Hey. So what are you saying? Sure. Sure. That's all that for that. That's what I was doing. They didn't wow. even they didn't even attack. They didn't even attack. That's interesting. I don't understand. Why would you not attack? I don't follow. That was kind of weird. Deck on performance college sucks confirmed. That's not that's not the lesson here. It's like Whirler Rogue makes two more blocky boys. Well, those blocks. Yeah. Or you can play Jace, but doesn't really do much. Good thoughts use an impulse. I think that's great. We hit a land drop for the turn. I'm just gonna play this guy. Mana Tithe! I haven't seen a Mana Tithe in this cube yet, but... You're about to. Oh, dang it. Oh, dang it. Mike's really upset that I didn't get Mana Tithe there. Well, because it would have been good Gotham. I, I don't like Gotham's at the expense of my own my own goodness. That's fair. Yeah, that is fair. It's not about being fair. It's not about what's fair! That's uh, Harvey Dent from The Dark Knight. Remember The Dark Knight? The Darkest of Nights. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. The Dark Nut. What? Nothing, man. Don't worry about it. You know about the Dark Nut? I don't. Tell me about it. You know in Zelda, the Dark Nuts? What? In Zelda, the Dark Nuts? No. No. Oh. I don't know Zelda, the Dark Nuts. Is that, a real, is that a thing? Is that a real thing? No, they're, they're called Dark Knights. Oh, God. 
Morgan Freeman made the best Batman. Worth noting that Hazard has since left the stream since last round, so that's fun. Then are we playing a different person? Right, but I'm saying, like, after we lost that round, he's also gone. disappeared. And, yeah, that's yeah. really funny. How strange. Must have been a big fan, I guess. Big fan alert. I like being able to triple block her. Are you going to my face? I'll just take four. I don't know how we get past this. How can we get past this, Michael? Oh, yeah. It starts by drawing a land, I think. How does it end? It ends with us not drawing a land. That's what just happened. You mm -hmm. just saw it with your own eyes. I'm gonna literally going to impulse for a land here. Hey, look, I found a land. Not a white land, though. Well, who needs a white land? Us. We don't. We'll never need that. I guess we don't really need a white land. Burp, 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 burp. They have two lands in hand. That's nice to know. We're running with the Michaels of the night. Who's the Michaels of the night? We'll get through in the end. All right, but that didn't answer my question. I know uh huh. Nobody cares about your question. <laughs> nobody cares. Dang it, nobody? Not even your mother. She was actually like, wow. Michael, if you weren't my son, I would never look at you again. That's harsh, bro. Yeah, take it up your mother. Just because you expect it doesn't mean it's okay. Like it's, I mean, I don't, ex I don't expect it. I expect, I actually, as a human being, I expect people to be uh, reasonable and, and just and, and moral. Uh, that's my expectation. Um, so yeah, every time when someone like snipes or, you know, it feels like they have to cheat at a cube draft on magic online because they're too big of a loser to, uh, to actually win on their own merit. Yeah, it gets to me. I mean... I'm just saying cube draft, man. Right. A cube draft is like the most low stakes fun draft you can actually play. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They're just going to wait until next turn. It's funny because we're drawing a lot of extra cards here. Jace is actually second Jace is actually pretty good against them, but then we don't have Force of Will up, and that's kind of sad. And now we just drew two lands, but neither of them are white. I also don't know how we navigate this game to a victory. I also don't know how to do that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Like them sacrificing this to destroy up to like this, this, and this. Get this back and then get all three of these back is pretty terrible. I agree. I mean, we can't attack into it. You said we can't? We can, I said. Yeah, but I mean, like, we got to take down three dudes to do it. Which is pretty insane when they have History of Benalia coming up, and they can also just make an emblem with Soren, and it's like... Bjorn, what's going on, buddy? They do ult Soren next turn, that is correct. Well, I mean, they might... It'd be insane not to. But then, like, does that still do anything? Like, their knights get big. Knights get big. Did they not play a land? Because they have two lands in hand? That's weird. Knights get big. 
Do you know about the Knights Get Big song? No. It sucks. Actually, I do know about it. Wow. Because I just heard it from your mouth. <laughs> I heard it from your mouth. Okay, man. Take it easy. Never. Oh, I'm so serious. Boom, ba, boom, 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 boom. If only we had a uh, an Emrakul here, we can attack them, make it unblockable. Wouldn't that be cool? Yeah, that'd be all right. Wouldn't that be cool? Yep, just gonna play this in plus. I do not feel like we have very many options here. Steven C., what do you know about death? Boom, ba, boom, boom. My name is Michael, and I live in the garbage can. Michael is a singer in a band. Michael is dimensional in his Michael face, and then he's making emblems with a sword and Lord of Innistrad. Hey, this is Sword Lord of Innistrad. Do you want me to send some soup? Yeah, send some soup, Sammy. Yeah, buddy. You know it is. You know it. You can go get them for like a dollar, man. I don't know why you're spending. Show me where on. you can get a dollar pencil at. The grocery store. No, wait. That is. <laughs> well, actually, you probably can't get them at a grocery store these days. I know a lot. I died yesterday. Oh, dang. Oh, dang. They had two turns to top take this Vindicate, and they did. That's really cool. They had cool. a one turn window when we took down the Force of Will where we didn't draw a second blue card, and they, they did it. What are the odds? It's like 100% because they're playing against us. Oh, blah, D. Oh, blah, da. Mike goes on. Bra. What? Never mind. Yeah. Think about, you think, about it what, think about what you say next time. I was thinking, like, why didn't you make the one guy unblockable? That would have killed it because you targeted it. So that, that, I, that was correct. smart of you to not do that. I also want to block with this, and I don't want to block with this. So that would have it would have killed it if you targeted it. Oh yeah, attack with these guys. Oh yeah, send them on in. Send them through. It's lit. Oh. Oh. Where are we going to eat, man? Chocolate factory. I got no chocolate factory for dinner. Why not? Okay, where is it? Let's go. It's right next to the chocolate pool. It's next to the chocolate pool. Which is in St. Pete. What the hell is the chocolate pool? I'll, I'll never tell. Is that because you're handicapped? <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, I'm handicapable. Mm, false. Wow. It's messed up. This is an aggressive move. All these, all these little idiots went to... Oh, this you're attacking us too? Hmm. Well, I'm definitely killing you if I get the chance. You should have killed me when you had the chance, Charles! Oh, death touch. Can I wear these to the dinner? 
What dinner at the chocolate factory? Yeah. In St. Pete? Yeah. Yeah, man. Cool. You know else you can wear to dinner? Your what? friggin' stupid face. Well, yeah, I can't really take that off. I can. I'll do it later. <laughs> uh, no thanks. I think I'm good. I'd like I didn't to keep, ask. I like to keep my face. Oh, like a blue card. Oh, look, a blue-black land. Also when the comes to play tapped, which is nice. That is my favorite part of lands. Na, 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 na. Desmond and Molly Jones. Ha, 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 ha. Michael is a good do 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 Michael, do, 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 Why do you always put me in your songs, man? <laughs> <laughs> because I just want you to feel a little bit of fame, buddy. <laughs> I have plenty of fame on this stream, okay? Yeah, maybe that's true, buddy. And then, I feel like uh, we should be super dead by now. I think like our. I opponent, agree with you. I think our opponent could navigate this game way better. I don't know why we're still alive. Oh, I'm still alive here. Oh. I'm still alive, Michael. Ah, yeah. What did you say to me? Nothing. I didn't say nothing to you. I will slam your face into someone else's face and it'll be a face off. Okay. Thank you. Relaxing Sam. What's going on? Sammy, thank you so much, buddy. Don't leave. I'm trying to send you money for soup. <laughs> I am not going anywhere, my dude. Michael wants to go to the chocolate factory, though. <laughs> if you guys can Google that for us and let us know what you find, really appreciate it. It's going to be some inappropriate club. Wow, I was just thinking of the movie or the book, but I guess if you want to take it there. Why can't Obnixilus kill other planeswalkers? I don't know. We have one, two, three, four, five blockers. They have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight creatures. So three one ones get through at worst. Then we can go block, 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 block. And then we take three. Oh, they didn't make an emblem. I feel like they should have been making emblems like years ago, like a thousand. Like if you if you went back in time four hundred years ago, that's when they should have been making an emblem. If you had a time machine, you could go back a thousand years ago, and then you could make them an emblem, and that would have been the correct time to do it. Hey, there you go, right there you go. Chocolate factory confirmed. Thank you. This is in Israel. This is not in Israel. This is in St. Pete. <laughs> what in the earth, man? See, I told you. The chocolate really, factory in St. Pete. None of this is okay. None of this is okay. Hold on. You're sending everything at me and then one stone forge at Jace. Okay, so you're going to block here. You're going to block here and here. And you're going to block here. And you're going to block here. And we're going to take three. I think it's more important to go to their flyers. This has all been very strange, and I have no idea. Oh, I keep F6-ing, but I have Force of Will in hand, for crying out loud. No. I like that they did this... They, they made this attack with the intent of being able to, like, make a guy post-combat and then play their sword. And no. Now. Oh, they could have just... 
I don't know why they have an emblem. Like they could have made like five emblems. Emblems. Emblem. Am ambulams. I'm your emblem. Your emblem. Let me am. Can we just let Jace go and draw one, or do we both draw one? I let him go. Really? We have to get rid of this, right? Can we do yeah. it? Can we do it? They only have four guys on board and a shambling method they can't activate at the current time. I don't know why they tapped both of these because now they can't activate this. A lot of questionable choices here. You just got to be careful so we don't die. <laughs> That's what I say every you day. You play Ob and kill one of their dudes. We're going to both draw a card here. It's a white spell. We can play Ob. We can also keep up a remove soul if we do that, which is pretty nice. I don't know how many cards we're going to be drawing with it, but... Okay, so this is two, three, four. No, this is actually perfect, right? Because these because these come two, two. So this is actually six damage at at Soren. Will this she have to deal the combat damage to a player for that or no? Oh God! So we go face. Yeah. <sighs> Shut up and take my money. For some tasty, tasty in a chocolate bar from Mike, I'm glad you're... Thank you, Sammy, so much, buddy. You are awesome, dude. Really appreciate your support, always. You are a wonderful dude. Remember that time we didn't get a white mana for, like, a million years? Uh-huh. <laughs> buh -huh. So the problem is if we have we have to play one more to Soren, but then they have five, five guys. We can block two. So we take three. Yikes. That's... We don't have to kill Soren. We can just do some damage to him. If they make an emblem, we're probably just as good as dead. Oh, yeah, true. Okay, so this is actually fine. We can block with these. We can block one three on the two four, and we can kill one of these. We'll take three. We'll go to one, and then we'll never be able to use Obnixilis again. I think we're doing it. Plus, these guys are just significantly better after that. God, can we get, like, one lifelink creature? Oh, my God. That Soren was unbelievable. All right. No spells. Only a really good creature. I want you to tap out for, like, a Lyra. One, two, three, four, five. Tap out for an Alesh Norn. If you went forward in time a million years, it would, do, it would take a million years to draw planes. That sounds correct. I can't believe you guys found a chocolate factory in St. Pete. That's insane, and I'm so uncomfortable with it. <gasps> what? They're Swords to Plowshare Drana. That's fantastic. Wouldn't you Swords to Plowshare this guy and then equip this? And then you can get in for like a million? I mean, I'm fine with it. Sure. I mean, we already... The damage is done there, my dudes. My doodles. What is this? What is happening right now? What are we doing? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sayonara. Oh, you still have more. I think you're just activating. No, you're playing another creature. Well, that's awkward. Just two, two, two really powerful board board altering five drops well now we can draw with Obnixilis wow hey man are you uh how you doing over there sorry I was texting are you talking to your mom no I'm poker group oh man whoa calm down we're no white, man. I can't believe we're still alive in this game we just drew three cards this turn Two, all three over lands how do we gain life because they sword Zardrana. It was about oh. five minutes ago. I can understand why you didn't realize. <laughs> I was also not paying attention, so that might have something to do with Correct. that. Correct. Correct. That was the point I was making. Uh, I'm just going to pass here. They have no cards in hand. They're in top tick mode. We have Obnixilis <sighs> and Jay Speller in. Coffee burn. Uh, coffee burn? Didn't you drink like a bunch of water? 
Yeah, but I got... Well, I meant heartburn from coffee. Oh, those are two different things. You are correct. I know. That's why I said it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven lands. We have seven lands left. Six lands left in our 13 card deck. Half of our deck is land. Dude, I've got a hack for you. What is for it? Apple Pencil. You just take your it's knife good. No. and you use that to draw. You can only do it like once, though. Here we go. I'm tempted to just kill this. I mean, we are at six. I don't know how much damage we really want to take. One more. Oof. Eek. Eek. All right, I get it, eek. I get it. I get it, okay? Do you get it? Do you? Still at 20. It's going to be an uphill battle. Swamp. Sounds good. This guy. Sounds good. All right. Just going to be passing here. I don't feel like making anything unblockable, but I do feel like they also have two minutes less than us. Is this game one? Is this game one? I think it is. My mind is blown to smithereens right now. Yeah, I don't know why they made this a big, a big, big. Like, after they... Because they, when they were in Adrana was dead, we had double blockers here for it. Like, we can... <sighs> Never That's fails. Rude. Like, I did, literally did this so I could keep this alive and kill this, and they had one window to draw. Well, sometimes you, uh, you don't... You don't get to... You don't get things. Sometimes you don't get to things, you know? Mm -hmm. Come on, we can draw something here. We can draw... We can draw spellums. Give me our own spellum. That's a good one. That's what I'm talking about. Let's both draw a card. Fantastic. It's looking... Things are looking up. Everything's coming up Millhouse. Everything's happening. So if we attack with this, and then we tap these... Nah, I don't feel comfortable with that. Five. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen lands. Three lands in our deck. Still probably like 45. 45% of our deck. Seems good. They voted for Geist of Saint Draft? Who cares about that? I was like, I was like, okay, if they get this or this or this, we're in bad shape. All right, well, that's better. I guess the two cards you drew were gas, while the two cards I drew were lands. So that seems about par for the course. Can't do anything about that, right? So, make it so. All right, well, you're tapped out, so. I have no idea what's happening right now. I'd say we're in a bit of a rough spot. It's it's called a pickle. Okay, we're in a bit of a pickle. It's called a schnickel. We still don't have great attack, right? We could just double block with the tokens. Right. Seems good. I'm okay with that one. Don't We're be going down six cards. We do have to win this game at some point. I'll win it whenever I feel like it, Michael. Schmookle. You should feel like it soon. I'm working on it.
We're getting there. Do I want a Baleful Strix out here? I don't really want to draw the card, to be quite honest. We've got three cards. No, we're at six cards. Oh, that's actually fine. I was looking at cards in hand. <laughs> don't be silly. How is this real life? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. There are two lands. Three spells, two lands. What are the three spells? Let's try to figure it out. Uh, Cryptic Command would be Gas, but we took that out. Force of Will and Omnixilis were five drops. We saw both of those. That's fantastic. <laughs> what? Can't. I'm dead now. Well, I wouldn't draw any more cards to Jace. I mean, we have a pretty sizable clock. Yeah. But they do have the back pocket of attacking with those four guys to gain four life sometimes. The back pocket? Yeah. They got the back pocket. He got the back pocket. You can make him draw cards. Huh? Huh? You know that? No, because then we draw cards too and they have 15 cards. Hmm. I feel much more comfortable with attacking now. It always feels like they got the back pocket. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, two down. I think they're dead next turn unless they draw something really spectacular. Multiple spectaculars. Ooh. Mother of Schmod. That was not a reasonable match. I like Magister worth in this matchup. They get all they get all tokeny and we're like, no. Nah. Bruh. Bruh. I don't like Geist of Saint Trap. That guy's gonna get blocked all day. see that although he really didn't he re got real scared of it apparently I wish we had a way to deal with artifacts I am a little scared of sword but it's not one of our worst swords so you mean it's not our colors really well I guess blue What? Pearl blue. It's actually pretty good. A lot of our dudes are blue. Actually, not really. Do you ever shut up? Oh, I'm sorry. Is this a no-talking stream? It's always a no-talking stream until you get all chatty, and then it's like, oh, wow. Mike's really coming to life. I come to life. Fast, fast cars. Yeah, that's nice. Like, you caught that reference. Glasses fell down. I know. I did it with my eyebrows. That was my intention, yeah. <laughs> Look, I'll do it again. There you go. Be beautiful. God, <laughs> beautiful. Oh, we could splash right to deal with the sword. That's true. It feels like an equation. We can go Manic, Vandal, and uh, bring in Murderous Redcap. 
feels like an equation. What does that mm-hmm. mean? It means we'd have to do a lot of work to splash red. I agree. Oh, God. If we can get it one blue, this hand is actually magnificent. We do have a lot of blue sources, right? It's like the most. I think it is the most, yeah. I'm going to keep it because we still have Brain Maggot and we're on the draw. So there's a lot of things working. Remember when you vetoed the Manic Vandal? I do. He knew what it was. Oh, they went to six? All right. They have six minutes to win this match. That means two games. That's not. That's See, sometimes you ask for an island or a blue mana source, and they give you a blue card instead. And it's it's understandable. Magic's kind of dumb, so it gets a little confused sometimes. But, you know, still, nonetheless, a little frustrating. Yep, that's a black card. Again, two lands. Totally get it. I understand. Two lands is a normal amount to get when you drew 16 in the previous game. But all is dust. What the smudge? You don't have a third land? Well, it looks like we're even then. Fascinating. Fascinating. All colored permanents. What the shoot? It's a big boy. What else do they have that they can get? Lightning Greaves? Yeah, I'll just take the sword. So we have Stoneforge, all is death. All is death. He had all is death. <laughs> Did you like that? Yeah, it's pretty good. He got the all is death. Yep, you got that. You got your Lightning Greaves. Do you got greedy boys? No land? Deal. Let me get... Let me get that land. A. That's like the best land we could have drawn, my dudes. Let's get another land. Double black? Drana. Drana's good. Yeah, let's take a Drana. I, t- I tap seven and cast Olive Duck. <laughs> <laughs> Same, buddy. Same. Oh, no. What will you do? It's going to equip them booties. Booties? Mm-hmm. Shooty tooties. Oh, no, it has haste. It's so fast. Right. I don't even know what this is. Like, I still look at the art and I'm like, what's even happening in this art? It's a construct. Oh. It looks like a bug. They didn't attack? I don't understand. Oh, that was a good draw. My confusion is real. <laughs> oh, they hit a land, though. So now we know they have Wrath of God, All is Dust, and one rando card. So you probably stop playing creatures. And that's what I'm thinking, but like... We could also just Phantasm Image this and steal their Wrath of God. That's true. I don't want to play anything else out into a Wrath of God. I can't play these two. Playing this is a great recovery card after Wrath of God. They could also just not hit a land so we could get a Drana... I think we're just gonna play draw. Drawing kind of forces the issue. Too. I'm gonna just I'm gonna just risk it for the La Biscuit. Come on, no whammies, 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 no whammies. Oh, did we get the no whammies? Okay, well, Drawn has first strike, so I think they have wrath here. Maybe he just wants to get it back. Maybe. You know he can't do that without black man and a creature in the graveyard. They probably just didn't have drawn head first strike. That's my guess. Yep, that's what happened. Okay. Um, let's get a second island because then we have everything we need. That was a future car if I ever heard one. Get in my future car. You must go now. I think we should have Phantasm Image first in case they had a removal spell for the Drana. Oh no. Oh no, this is all going badly. 
Oh no. Oh, butter, butter biscuits. Butter, butter biscuits. Butter, butter biscuits. Let me see those butter, butter biscuits. Okay, I will choose Wrath of Schmood again. So now your hand is Angel, Seraph, All is Dust, which is extremely ambitious. And we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven power on board. I think the game just ended. This was a long match. Yep, that is the end. All right. Good times. Wow, this 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 match was very strange. Do you concur? Michael, yeah, do you it was concur? A, it was a weird first game. Do you concur? I concur, okay? God. He concurs. Concur with your mom. What does that mean? That means we both agree. Makes sense. That's very wholesome. Oh, shit. This is Chef Jeff Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> wow. The famous Chef Jeff Gordon Ramsay. Yeah, that's a weird... The, the Jeff coming in there in the middle is really weird, but all right. Yeah, his secret first name is Jeff. Oh, his name is Jeff? Yeah. Uh, my name is Jeff. Oh, God. Why did I start? Oh, uh, uh, why? <laughs> why did I say it? Why didn't you? No! Why wouldn't you say it? It is his name, though, so... My name is Jeff. It's not his name. His name isn't Jeff Gordon Ramsay. It isn't? What about all those fans of Jeff Gordon? That's, that's not the same guy? No, you might be right. I think that is the same guy. <laughs> well, I'm definitely getting uh, an island, a mountain, a uh, swamp here. Because next turn, if we draw like Drana, we can play Drana on three. Followed by a Jace. Or we can play basically whatever. We can still play Geist of St. Traff. My name is Jeff. Is it? Crutch Jr., is your name Jeff? Crutch Junior, I realized I also have an I have a I also have a stipulation from you from the last previous cube. It's a fun wildfire upheaval deck. Uh upheaval and wildfires must be taken. Everything else is your choice. Um but there's no wildfire in this cube, which makes it a little more difficult. So I think we're just gonna wait until Vintage Cube comes back. Or when the next whenever the next cube is that has wildfire and upheaval in it. Or if we can pick an upheaval early, we'll do that. But Relaxin' Jeff, that's not your name? Sorry, I don't know that. Oh, I see. I see. Well, let's see what we got. What we got. I think I kind of like go for the throat a little bit better here. Can't we just keep them both? I don't think so. Dang it. Or do I like Mentor here? I think I, I'll just take the Mentor. We already have Obnixilis for, for any sort of shenanigans. Yeah, the stip based on one card is rough because you have to actually find that card. Um, but as long as the people doing it don't mind waiting until that card shows up, <coughs> it's kind of okay. <laughs> Who was that, guys? I just did an impression for you guys. Who was I? <laughs> <laughs> wow I'm offended good sir actually you're not a good sir you're a shit sir a what? a shit sir what's that? it's kind of dog <laughs> oh that's neat oh wow they put a land on top that's super cool I would argue it's not super cool you would be right that's search for a creature Jokes on you. Oh, oh, what if I mentor and then I phantasmal image the mentor? How do you feel about that? What did they get? Oh, worm coil engine. One, two, three, four. Oh, we're just going to copy that. Copy that. Oh, there's a kitty cat in here. Oh, a kitty cat. Can I steal you and show you? Can I show you off to everyone? Yeah. He is a little kitty. This is little man. This is the loud gentleman. Mao. 
He's handsome. All right, you want to go up here? Okay. All, All right, right he, he, he don't, but that's fine. <laughs> cat on stream. <laughs> He's right, you know. There was a cat on stream. Okay, this is obnoxious. What we can do is copy it. And copy that. And then we can ob it. Copy it and ob it. Yes. Um, alternatively, we can go... Jace this turn, then Phantasmal and Compulsive next turn. And we can just block with the do with the Jace token here, which would be nice. The Jace token. I hate you. I just want you to make sense. <laughs> so many cats. This are this is a lot of cat emotes, good lord. I don't know what to do here. You know what to do. Can we copy Stripe Warm Call Engine? What? I was reading from the chat. Copy Strike? What does that mean? Is that a move? Is that a super move? It's, not, it's like what you do on YouTube. You copy Stripe people. There was this YouTuber that was just like basically saying in her stream how she was going to copy Stripe people. It was really messed up. Wow. Yeah? You heard? What about Wah? You heard? With Purd. Give me this thought season, this force of will. That's all I want. <laughs> yeah, I'll give you the two best ones. I'm sure that'll happen. Come on, Chef Gordon Ramsay. Chef Jeff Gordon Ramsay. Thank you. No, I didn't do it. Dang it. I'm still taking whatever two pile I get. That's pretty nuts. Just having Force of Will and being able to kite self Freebooter and Phantasal Image next turn is pretty insane. I heard about the, I heard that the bird might be the word. How's everybody? Oh, that's scary. I don't think that's a, I don't think that's a concern though. Like you obviously know I have Force of Will, so you're not going to play your best spells out. That might kill us. It'll never kill us. That's a little bit scary, but we have Obnixilis. Is that everybody? So they have one, two, three, four mana free. Mama, mama, mana free. So they would get to deal what? One damage? Yeah, I don't care about that. Okay, so we can go plus you. We're just going to ob this guy, right? No. Yes, we have to before it untaps, right? Ideally. Ob makes a guy, we can block again. Has every Michael heard about the word ma 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 Michael heard? Yep, you get to flip this, which is fine. I don't care about that. I will make an Ashaya. Does have two cards in hand? Big. That's fine. This. All of this is fine. I heard it. The whole world heard it. You can't hide it. I wasn't trying to. You were, you were hiding it. What 
whatever you're doing here, it's not going to work. That, nope, that's, don't like that. Yeah, that's got to be. Has everybody heard about the word? Going face? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> Deal. I'll take Drana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. Mm, not enough. Not enough. Okay. So we're going to definitely play this. One, two. We can play everything but the freebooter. How worried are we of them having something good, though? I think we just have to throw this guy out there, unfortunately. Mm, Woodfall Primus. That's a good one. Do we just copy their Woodfall Primus next turn? Hmm. We could. Let's just play Drana and Mother of Runes this turn. I mean, if they play Woodfall Primus, they just get to kill our, our Worm Coil, right? No, it's non-creature. Interesting. Little Scoochie, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. I think I just like having Flyer and Mother of Runes on board, and the next turn we can copy Woodfall Primus. And copying something with Persist is so much better. Yeah, it's pretty brutal. Plus, it's the only card left in their hands. They kill a Planeswalker. That's not a big deal. Yeah, I think we're just going to do that. We could actually just attack the... Yeah, well, let's just kill the Nissa here. Actually, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Yeah, they have enough for Woodfall Primus here. Yeah, might as well kill the Nissa. Yeah, I don't think they need two extra cards this turn. Yeah, so another thing we can do is actually copy the Woodfall Primus, kill their Planeswalker, and then give our Woodfall Primus protection, and then when it comes back, we can copy the Wormcoil engine, so. Oh! That's pretty good. Yeah, so I'd rather have both. Okay, them doing that is nice, because it means they're probably just going to play Woodfall Primus this turn. What's your favorite, what's your favorite, what's your favorite band? Is it Woodfall Primus? No. Okay. Is it Devil Went Down to Georgia? Yeah, that's my favorite band, the song Devil Went Down to Georgia. <laughs> that's weird that you have a band as your favorite song. Wait. Nope, you did it wrong. Dang it, I did. Michael went down to Georgia. It would kill the image, which is why it persists. And then we get another target, which is the Worm Coil Engine. That's the whole point. That it would die. It and is because on of purpose. Persist, it would come back. Oh. It is trick, you see. <laughs> I'm just going to block here. Maybe. Probably, yeah. Yeah, I don't think we need to eat another six. But you don't they know. They have a lot of power on board. Yeah, but this guy's got trample is the problem. So, like, they're also at 37 life. That's a lot. That's nice. Get rid of this thing and uh... actually, we just killed a like a land, right? We just killed Gaia's Cradle here. Why? Because we can just attack the Garrick. 
Like we're going we're going face with Drana and like we can just attack with one flyer. I see your point. Also, we don't even have to target the um, the Woodfall Primus. We can just let it die on its own in combat to either one of their creatures. One thing we can do is Impulse to make this a 3-3 and this a 2-2. And then we can just block with Mentor, Monk, Monk on the on like the Woodfall Primus and block Woodfall Primus on... I don't want the Wormcoil Engine to die, though, is the thing. Because <laughs> I want to be able to copy it. I guess we'll see what they do. <gasps> oh my god, we can. The per the Drana triggers on the Persist. We can recopy this guy. Attack with both. And then because the first strike, this would, this would get another counter. So it would remove the... Wow. That's tricky. That is tricky. It's tricky. It's tricky. Trick. It's a little run DMC. Wow. This is aggressive. Oh, this is nice because our Woodfall Primus blocks their Woodfall Primus and don't even care. Oh, we're definitely yeah, do be pretty good. We're definitely doing this. Give me a swords. Oh my god, if we can find a swords here, can you imagine how good that is? Thoughtsies. Not good. I think we probably just want the Karn here. I think I just want the extra planeswalker. Yeah. Wrong one mana. Premium spell. spell. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, oh what now? So all face. All face is the place. So here's what we can do. Go to blocks. 6-6 six, six on 5-6. Don't care what they do. 3-3 three, three on 2-3. Three. Throw a 1-1 one, one away here. We take 4. No, I'd probably just block with Mother and protect it. Oh, sure. They have only one card in hand and they're mono green, so what can they really do? Right. And then we end up taking nothing. And their their Woodfall Primus comes back and gets to kill something, but I don't think we really care. No, because we get to get ours come back as well. Well, ours isn't going to die. All oh, right, Never mind. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, so we end up losing, like, one prowess guy. Uh, this doesn't have Trample, right? No. It better not, dude. Pro green. Yep, we get to kill. They'll probably kill the planes. Oh, no, they'll probably kill the Jace, right? Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> wow, this is looking very good. Yeah, we're like way ahead right now. Remove souls, the other card. Okay, so what we can do is copy this or bring this. Hmm, no, don't like that. We can just kill this. We can just kill this dude. Yeah. Say so we attack with Drana. How much flyer. damage do we do if we attack with everything, though? Like, if we swords this guy and just attack with everybody? Keep in mind there are 40. Right, I'm trying to figure it out. Four. Um, assuming these guys are... Okay, so three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <clears throat> plus six is 14, 15, 16. Um, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. That's a lot. Hmm. 
Hmm. I think we're just attacking with these guys. Not the prime boy? They just take six here, though. Like, I'd like to have this guy as a blocker. Like, if we block Worm Coil, it's just insane. <clears throat> I also like the idea of just giving this protection, having it come back, copying Worm Coil, maybe. And then in future turns, we just have Drana to, like, room the counter. I have no idea. I just want to play a little faster, though, because we have a lot of decisions to make here, which is pretty, f pretty ridiculous. We are three minutes behind. No, oh, I know it. Don't know if it's gonna matter, but it could. All right, I think we're still way ahead here. We can just easily get remove soul next turn and not have to worry about many of the things a green deck is gonna have. Yeah, that's fine. Immediate crack. Yeah, but at least I'm a three three mana too, so I'm just like, meh. Oh, uh, that's true. Yeah, we could attack with the Primus, I guess, and then give it pro, give it back as warm coil, then path the warm coil and block the. Yeah, that's definitely an option as well. The problem is I like that as a six six, it blocks either one of these and trades. If it's a five five, like we're not trading with with this, we're just or we're, we're just trading with this. We're not actually eating it. Hmm. I'm just gonna do this. I I don't I don't think this is the stronger threat that's keeping them in the game. And this is still gonna come back no matter what. So. That ain't gonna do it. Oof. Those are your last two? Yikes. We just put a card into our hand. We're just gonna we're just gonna grab the, the room of soul. Yeah, pretty much locks them out. Yeah, like we don't want to die to like a random crater hoof here. Um this guy will attack with. Because even if it dies, like, I can actually put all the damage on these guys and then just bring this guy back. Four, five, six, seven. We just eat three. That's totally fine. This is also a sizable clock right here. Drana and the one Kite Sail Freebooter are actually doing quite a bit of work here. Oh, yeah, do that. Um, I think we just kill this guy. That way we can make another one? Yeah. Because next turn this will be a 6-6 six, six attacker because of the drawn counter. So now we actually do have that kind of loop. Which is pretty nuts. Oh man, Villy, this this draft turned out to be pretty pretty sweet. I mean, these games turned out to be pretty pretty nuts. Yep, that's fine. Not gonna remove all that thing. You are not a threat to me. Um, let's reveal. <laughs> Island and Seraph, yeah. Well. We know what we're getting. Triggered. Time to get triggered, y'all. This is always a lot. I think we can attack with everything now. I feel like we Except can. Except for Mother, obviously. It gives us a lot of damage with Drama. I would like to do the math first. Because we have two dudes to, to stay back. Actually, this is five, six, seven, eight. They don't even have lethal on the way back, so no, they don't. Yeah, this is fine. This blocks here, and then we just give it pro green. Fine. 
math is for block. What is this? 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. This is 10. Alright, that's... That's okay. Yeah, Good. I'll just get a counter and come back, right? He doesn't even die. Well, he just... Yeah, he just gets a counter and doesn't die. Yeah, now they're super dead next turn. Now this is just a 6-6 six, six persist. Might as well play this just for the funsies. What do we got here? Dang it, kitty cat. No, we just win. Alright. They're like, I'll wait till you go to the combat step. Wrath of God seems great against this deck. Definitely. So does Magister of Orth. Sin Collector? I mean, they have Primal nah, Command. They're not going to have that many targets, though. Yeah, it doesn't hit Planeswalkers and stuff. I like these guys less. Yeah, we we'll probably just play like this. Uh, anything else that's really good? No. Mind Shatter's not terrible. I feel like they're going to empty a hand too much. Too quick for that, though. I like Cryptic Command. Probably over Geist, actually. It yeah, is Geist it is, is blue. It's, it's, it's blue intensive, but in the late game, it's just really nice. <laughs> Red Cap and Drana is kind of a combo, yeah. I mean, if that also assumes that also assumes that like Drana's not getting, yeah, we'll keep this. You'd be insane not to. It also assumes Drana's are uh, the Red Cap's not getting blocked to survive combat. Oh wow. Okay. Um. I think we do want a thought seize here, just because. Oh, hundred percent want a thought seize here. They might overfill us. So we're getting a swamp with this and a plains with that, presumably. Ulamog. Uh, hitting Tri-Builder here is kind of nice. Yeah, just keeping them off of... Uh... And they'll have a third land at, at this particular juncture. So They also have ways to find infinite lands with this hand. I might even ignore a white and just get a second black so we can play Drana and just have a knight. Oh, that's good. Now I should play Jace. Nah, I still kind of like the clock on Drana here, though. Oh, they hit a third land. Oh, that is nice. Wow, really? Rex Age? Okay. Yeah, I mean, it is what it is. We don't have that many targets for it anyway. We don't have that many targets for it anyway. I think we should play Drana. I do, too. I don't think we're anywhere close to being threatened out by uh, any of those other idiots. Whereas Drana could literally get out of hand. Take the maggot. It's the one we can cast. Okay. Well, now you have eight mana. Six mana. Okay, that's good. It's blue. That is a white. I'm just going to attack here, because if they want to block with Nissa, I'll trade Seagate Oracle for Nissa. Yep, that's what I figured you'd do. Definitely we're... we're well, pressure. the thing is, like... I just think we want to pressure them. Yeah, I agree with it. The thing is, if we play Jace, I want to get I want to get closer to making sure we can cast either one of these. Yeah, let's give Drawn a double strike. 
even if they cast either one of these, they still have to deal with four, five, five, six, six, seven flyer. Like Drana just wins in like three turns. They do have seven mana right now. Well, I mean, we could just play Brain Maggot next turn, actually. Yeah. And just rip the Woodfall, and then they're they're still kind of far from uh, Ulamog five, six, seven. Need eleven for that Ulamog, right? Or is he only ten? Uh, that's ten. No, this is eleven. Oh, this is the eleven Ulamog. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's the worst Ulamog. Oh. Oh my God. That's pretty good. Oh wow! They just miss. They misclicked on. Oh, did they? They they searched instead of. Oh. No, they no. They went to put in hand, and then they hit OK. They put up to two creatures from your hand on the battlefield, and then they clicked OK instead of clicking the cards in their hand. So they're clicking the card right now, and it's keep it's asking them to pay costs. Oh, that's why it keeps saying pay costs because they're clicking on the card, but it's asking them to cast it instead. So they. They done messed up a Ron. That's a br yeah. That's game. That's that's insane. Otherwise, they would have had an Ulamog and a Woodfall Primus. That is correct. That might they kill like an island. No, they don't get to cast them. Oh, you mean from the Woodfall Primus? Yeah, yeah. And this game is much different. This would have been We'd a actually much probably be dead because the Annihilator wow. we each couldn't deal with the Annihilator. Yeah, we not we didn't deserve to win this one. I don't think we didn't deserve to win. We don't deserve to win like this. But I definitely don't think we de don't deserve to win this one. Like, we attack with everything next turn. They're taking five, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, right? Eleven if they don't block. Eight if they do. Oh, just the Lowell concede? All right, well. Solid. All right. Anyway, <laughs> seems all right. Billy, thank you so much for the tip. Really appreciate it. Congrats again on getting into school and to getting into your master's program. Really super thrilled about that. And I was dead serious about uh, about visiting you because that sounds pretty sweet. But thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at meundies.com slash Frank Lepore. Uh, you get 15% off on the free shipping and free returns. You can also check out manatraders.com. And uh, you get 20% off your first three months of any subscription, paper or digital. You can use the promo codes and the links in the descriptions down there. And also you can check out coolstuffinc.com. You'll find articles that I write myself. I don't have help. And uh, you can use promo code FRANK5 to get 5% off your purchase there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I will see you next time.